Hello guys, today I will be talking about how gas turbines will change in the zero emission future. Recently, researchers at the University of Stavanger announced they have created a gas turbine that completely uses pure hydrogen as fuel. This is the first of its kind and can be used on a large scale. In addition, they have found a way to use hydrogen gas in the current natural gas infrastructure without needing to completely change the structure. They did say that it will be less efficient, but just having the ability to use the current infrastructure is just amazing. It means that we don't need to spend time and money making new turbines, and these old turbines won't need to be scrapped or dumped in a landfill, harming the environment even more. But further research needs to be started on the storage of hydrogen gas and how it needs to be handled. Okay. Now we have the structure, but how are we supposed to get the gas? It's not as simple as it seems because most hydrogen is produced by using fossil fuel. According to US Department of Energy, 95% of hydrogen comes from natural gas plants. So using this method would just be counterproductive and pretty ironic. So one way to overcome this issue is to find a clean and sustainable way of producing hydrogen. A research team at the same university has found a method of using solar energy to produce hydrogen. So, if they can find a way to combine these two methods, it will truly be a sustainable way of producing energy. Even though it may seem like a waste of time and money when we have solar panels, but remember, we are using infrastructure we have now, and instead of throwing them away, we are reusing them. In addition, hydrogen has other uses like in cars, rocket fuel, welding, fertilizers, paint, etc. As you can see, hydrogen has other purposes, so if this so if this turbine doesn't work out, it still have other uses. Thank you for watching the video, and if you enjoyed, make sure to like and subscribe. Peace out.